You thought about it? <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome to another video and welcome to Brands Hatch. I was going to say the wonderful Brands Hatch, but I'm not a massive fan of the circuit, especially in GT3 cars. So we're doing the Fanatec GT3 Challenge. It's week three. I'm going to try and do every race of the season to see where we end up at the end of the season with regards to championship points. And we have qualified for this one, P5, with a 122.456. It's super close between P2 right down to P8. So this is anybody's strength of field for this one is about 3.3k. At any point during this video, if you do like what you see, please remember, click on that like button. That would be much appreciated. So, 20 minutes fixed setup around Brands Hatch in the old Merc. Let's get on track. The track temp is 19 Celsius. The air temp is 17 Celsius. Okay, here we go. I've been avoiding this all week. Follow car number 6. Brands Hatch isn't my favourite track to drive in any car, never mind GT3s. But we've somehow managed to qualify P5, which I didn't expect, with a 22456. Uh, slower on the second lap by a tenth or so. I still don't know how to drive the Merc around here, whether to downshift a second in a couple of places, you know, and rev the nuts off the car or try and keep it nice and smooth in third. But no doubt we'll try and figure it out as the race goes on. So brake bias, I've opted for 52.8. Tried higher, tried lower. That's kind of a happy medium. It's still sometimes a little bit sketchy into turn one. So right in front of us there, Mitchell McLeod. McLeod40 on Twitch, Twitch streamer, nice guy, quick guy, likes his beer. So he's going to be pushing on, no doubt. And the guys behind, well, they're all quick, aren't they? They're all quick. So if we can hold on to P5, I'll say it right now, if we can hold on to P5, I'll take it. So here we go then, 20 minutes fixed setup around Brands Hatch Grand Prix circuit. It's going to be tough. Okay, Dave, are you ready? Watch for the lights. Go, go, go. God damn it, guys, really? That's 20 minutes to go. Just want to survive. Car left, clear left, car left. What was that about? Hold your line. Clear left. So this is one of the corners where I don't know whether to go out second or leave it in third. So we're up one. Simon got uh, mugged off there. Oh, Mitch, don't start blinking. Still going. One lap nearly done. Wow, 
got 14 more to go. Okay, Dave, keep doing what you're doing. This is spot on, P4. So great through there, Tiff. Losing these guys a little bit now. The leader has just done a 122.18. The guy in front has just done a 122.47. Whoa! Jeez. I'm going to cover the inside line because he'll go for it. Car left. Clear left. The easiest track to overtake ground, Brands Hatch, either. So if you can remain consistent and a reasonable pace, then it's really difficult for somebody to get past you. Now we need to sort out turn one. The leader's just done a 22.02. Your lap time was 22.73. The guy ahead has just done a 22.28. Hard, make them work for it. That's it. So nearly five minutes in, we're still alive. Fifteen minutes remaining, fifteen minutes to go. Okay, Dave, keep it nice and smooth. Come on, let the race come to us. Do with that guy in front catching with Mitch, to be honest. Instead of clearing off. If those guys started battling behind, that would be ideal. Oh, a bit slightly. Lost a bit of time.
pulled out a bit of a gap there on Alberto. He's closed it back up now, though. The leader has just done a 121.84. Twenty one eight four, that's crazy, isn't it? That's crazy. Just not getting that turn right. That's all, that's what's costing us the time every lap. It's all over you. Keep your exit speeds up, stay smooth. That lap time was 22.67. OK, Dave, your lap time's pretty consistent. Oof. That's bad. Every single lap. Oh, that was a cut. Under pressure, under pressure. Okay, Dave, 10 minutes to go. That's 10 minutes left. Stay calm, keep it smooth. Half distance, fuel looks good. Oh, he's got another run. Try and keep it tight. Left side. He's still there. Clear left. I don't fancy having to defend for 10 minutes. Jeez. Can't get it up right. <sighs> 
Stick to the plan. Don't be intimidated here. I don't know where else you can make the move though. Maybe a lunge into turn two. Oh, the battling ahead. The driver in front of us is McLeod. Better, better. I think I'm just changing down a second too early, I think. I don't know when Simon's going to make his move on the guy behind. Simon's lost a couple of positions. <sighs> Nearly on the grass then, folks. See if we can change down a bit later. Yeah, I think that's my issue. Car's just been over-rotating when I've been going down a second. All right, Dave, 10 minutes of fuel remaining. If I would lose safety rating with one instant point. Good consistency. Keep them coming. Where it happens. Oh no, he's gone out. He thought about it. <laughs> he thought about it then. I, I didn't really want to defend that. I had carnage written all over it there. I'd rather have just conceded that. Sort it out, Dave. Sort it out. It's getting a bit closer now.
Yeah, he's getting closer. Getting into the championship rounds now, is it? If it was a boxing match, closing stages. People dig a little bit deeper, find something that they haven't found. This is what started on the last lap, that turn. I messed that up big time. Who's gone off in Sterling's yellow flag? Oh. Watch out, push harder. We can get a podium Blimey. here. Stakes have just gone up. Podium now. Lost a bit of time as well. So, two more laps. Two minutes to go. Two minutes. P3. Yeah, I think second's better there. He needs he needs me to get a bad run out of there so we can set it up two or three corners down the road. We won't get the move done here, but it can get the move done the turn after. which is on the grass. Is it last lap? No, two more to go. Oh, yes, last lap, last lap. We've got a little bit of draft now, which might help us out a little bit. OK, Dave, one more to go. Keep it together, we'll be on the podium. Sectors one and three are two tenths off the pace. Sector two is zero point four three off the pace. That's five minutes of fuel left. No, 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 no. Just two minutes left, two minutes to go. Car right. Still there. <laughs> Have we got it? Still there. Looks like the leader has gone off in. Yes. <laughs> Clear right. <laughs> what a good podium. race. Good drive. Oh, Alberto, sorry, I had to defend so much there. Good racing. Good job, Mitch. Just nice one. Right, let's have a look at the carnage. Okay, let's have a look at what went on. There was something happened at the beginning. I heard somebody. I think it was Ferdinand that was uh, saying something at the beginning. But apart from that, apart from P2 going off, I don't think a lot happened, or we didn't see it anyway. Oh my word. Is that on the parade lap? It is. What's he done here? Warming up the brakes. Ah, just didn't slow down soon enough. Oh, no. I would have packed up at that point and gone home. All right, so this is the beginning, right? This is, this is what happened. Oh, my word. What was that Lambo doing? Number 11, that's on you. 
Oh, and that poor guy got taken out. Oh, crikey. Race pretty much over. Right, that was the guy that was behind us. Nothing happened there. No, there's going to be a few of those down this dip. It's going to register an incident, no, no doubt there. Mitch, nothing happened with Mitch. Let's see what happened here. This has got potential. No. Losing it on entry, yep. Yeah. There we go. Oh, and that poor Lamborghini got uh, pushed right onto the grass. Now, this has got potential, definitely. Yeah, there we go. The classic punt to pass. I've been guilty of a punt to pass in the past. Just saying. What's in there? Is he going to lose it again here? He is. Oh dear. Nothing there. Nothing with Mitch. Nothing here. No, nothing. Yep, he's gone. Oh, this must be P2. Ah, oh, just a couple of wheels on the grass. Oh, and he can't go anywhere. Good job for waiting, though. No, nothing coming, is there? No, he's all right. Is he going to lose another position, though? I think he is. Yep. Is this him again? So he's taking one position back. Oh, he's losing it. Oh, if he didn't get hit, then he would have he would have lost that. 100%. Oh, no. What's that? Thankfully, he came off worse than anybody. Where's this guy going? That must be the end of the race. It is. Right, let's have a look at the results. Okay, then. So, there were four splits. This was top split, strength of field, 3,265. So, we didn't lose any safety ratings, so we're still at 4.99, but we gained... A nice little chunk of I rate in 50, so that takes us to 4,341. So Caden got the win, Mitchell got P2, and we managed to get P3, one incident point. So who's the biggest winner? Uh, it looks like it's Mitchell in P2, he gained 68. And the biggest loser is Ferdinand, he lost 78. So there we go, we've got a podium, P3, a nice big chunk of I rating, didn't lose any safety rating. That was a tough battle. I had to defend for 15 minutes there, and I don't really like defending that much, because I know how frustrating it is when you're behind. But we managed to hold on to the position, P3. So if you did like this video, please remember, click on that like button. And if you want to see more, then please consider subscribing to the channel. As always, thanks for watching. See you later. Cheers.